Courtney, you lied to me. You lied. What did I lie about? You told me that Nick ran this whole thing. No, I didn't. He ran the company of talking with famous people. I never said that, Taylor. Don't look at me like that. Talking, talking with famous people. I do run shit, though. You are a thespian. I am a thespian, yes. You like to thesp. When people get on my nerves, or people lie, or they engage in fuckery, I like to tell them about it. You shoot from the hip. Yes. You're a straight talker. <laughs> no. Eric and I have been discussing psychopathy. Well, I don't always get to be fighty and have it win on like a feeler level. Typically, around here we get engaged in ti shit and then i have yeah. to tamp out because i'm like i don't know what the fuck i'm talking about that sounds like you make a good journalist then maybe but no sure you would it's anything but objective <laughs> entp is not quite like the psychopath they actually are very <laughs> dependent upon positive nice friendly moods and atmospheres around them you're getting two shoes Oh, I'm a very good at two shoes. I used to like to tell the teacher. Why have you brought me here? I like pudding. What Nick has total charge of, uh, especially now that Pepsi is gone, is closest person to the fucking camera. You know, if you look into someone's eyes for long enough, they may fall in love with you. The greatest tactical geniuses have been the SFPs. For instance, uh, Julius Caesar, uh, Hannibal, um, Monkey D. Luffy. It's the ESTP, I'd say, is that's more likely to be, in its extreme form, leading psychopathy. Oh, Courtney, you lie! A way that a bunch of feelers diagnose people who are assholes. How much but... do you guys actually sleep? Damn you all, I'm not getting any work done now, for sure. Good. Before Taylor was like, keep my name out of your mouth. Since I inherited the uh, high cheekbones. Narcissism is interesting. Like, the question is, where does it come from? But you like to jump around topics, right? You're honestly dishonest. Honestly, it's the honest ones you've got to watch out for because you never know when they're going to do something incredibly stupid.